What's going on guys? Talk Aston Villa here bringing you another video and this is episode number 6 of Aston Villa Transfer News. If you haven't seen this from my channel before or my channel, like, comment, and subscribe. The just the, the feedback has been great guys and I really appreciate it. You guys are just amazing and leave a like. Um, it would be greatly appreciated. So now we're going to start like we always do for the Mighty Villa. It's basically uh, just going to be the outs and then the ins finish on a really positive note and that's what I like to do. So on the outs, Brett Holman looks like he signed a two-year deal and is going to leave Aston Villa for United Arab Emirates Club. Al Nassar, uh, the 29-year-old midfield that wants to play for his national team, which is Australia, in the 2014 World Cup in Brazil. Uh, basically saying that if he doesn't get enough playing time, he's not going to be selected. And I understand that, especially again that that age, you want to do as much as you can with the limited time you have left. I don't think going to Al Nassar is the right move because you're not going to get looked there, in my opinion. But I'm not dissing that league. Nothing against it. Um, basically, he was Alex McLeish's last signing. So Villa fans, if you're wondering who brought him in, it wasn't Lambert. It was McLeish. I don't agree with the signing at all. Why he did that, but yeah, it's 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 McLeish. Um, featured in nearly 30 games this season, but only started roughly around 16, so you can see his concern. Uh, thanks for your contributions for the year. Thank you. <laughs> Anyways, and the follow-up to Eric Lehigh, it does look like he's going to Nottingham Forest. Looks like he passed a physical, a medical, and all that good stuff. Signed a two-year deal, just a few other things to work out. So if you're a Lehigh fan, I thought I'd just let you follow up, because yes, he has contributed to Villa, the 24-year-old right back, and if you're a fan of him, I thought I'd help you out to know where he's going. Uh, if you didn't know that already. Now the ends. We've signed two more players. That's five so far. I think we'll sign about that eight or nine mark. We I think we need to add one or two veterans because that experience really helps. Like, look how much given benefit it goes in. I think that really helped. Um, so, yeah, Nicholas Fellaini is the 22-year-old striker from uh, Aalborg BK in the Danish League. Was named UEFA's... Uh, Danish Super League player of the year for this past season, so the 2012-2013 season, scored 16 goals and 33 appearances with 7 assists. That's a young, promising striker. I can't wait to see if Benteke stays. Learn off Benteke, and just th that's going to be deadly. It just It's someone who actually begged their club to let him leave to come to Villa, and I like that. It shows that he has passion for the club. He wants to be a part of what's going on, the revolution, as I say. Uh, so yeah, next Antonio Luna, and this just came out the, yesterday, the day before that, the 22-year-old left back from Sevilla for undisclosed fee. I don't really know fees that much, so if I don't say it, I apologize. Uh, I'm sure it's not that much. Uh, only played for four times this past season for Sevilla, and then was loaned out to Real Morca, or, or Morca. Don't know how to pronounce that, so I apologize. But yeah, that's two promising signings. I still do think we need a, venture, uh, a couple of veterans if... Ireland leaves, I, I honestly think that we're going to get Belhanda. I, I don't want to be cocky, but I think there's that opportunity to get Belhanda if we can get rid of, obviously it looks like Holman's going to leave. We can free up that space, maybe get him. I, I'm, I, honestly, that team's going to be a scary force. Um, so, yeah. Anyways, guys, this has been episode number six for Aston Villa Transfer News. This has been Talk Aston Villa. Like always, like, comment, and subscribe. It's always appreciated. And remember, yep, subscribe. Peace out.